Hello, good evening. Can you hear me? Yes, hello, good evening. I can hear you. Okay. Hi, Daisy. Hi, Lisette. Hi, David. Hi. Hi. Is this your first time in English? No, the second course. Okay. Thank you, David. Yes, this is the second course as well. Okay. Thank you, Daisy. You're welcome. Norma, is this your first time? Yes, not the first class. Okay, okay, perfect. Well, in a few moments, we're going to have more people, but we are going to get started. Uh, my name is Edwin. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Good. Nice uh, to does everyone know how to use the platform? Yes, I have it. Yes? Yes, I have. Okay, perfect. Okay. Well, then it's good because then you know that the important in the platform is to make sure you complete all of the activities. Okay. Okay. Um, I saw some of you had the opportunity to look today at today's topic. Do you know what we're going to study today? Lisa? Passive. Correct. Just mm -hmm. Today we're going to study the passive. Okay. As you can see. And Jose, can you read? Yes, teacher. Can you read the, what is the objective for today's class, please? Well, in the class, the perfect okay. plan will be the first introduced the class you survive. Okay. But That's... someone is uh, okay. making noise in now. I don't know. I think we're going to mute in just a second. I think that's it, but just in case. Okay, so you're right. Today we're going to be looking at the idea of the passive voice. And hang on, let me close this down so we can get everybody there. Okay, so do you, the passive voice is really, the idea is, um, what we use it for is like when we want to explain an accident, when we want to tell a story, when we want to show somebody else uh, who does the activity. We're going to start by watching a small video. If you don't understand the video, don't worry. I'm going to explain it at the end of the video. Can everybody see? Yes. 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 Okay. I barely hear it. You can't hear it? No. No? Okay. No. All right. Then let me double check and make sure we have more options. Mm 
think we got everything. It says sharing, but I don't think, let me see if you guys can hear that. Can you hear that? A little bit. A no. little bit. No. A little bit. Hmm. I don't think I can make it louder. Let me try here. No teacher. No, nothing. No. Okay. Then give me just one moment, we'll see what I can do. Um, I already have the volume, the volume. We have more. Show wonders. Okay, well, then I'll explain it um, because you can hear me, right? Yes, clear. Yeah. Yes? Okay. All right. Then I'll show you the video and I will explain what she's saying. I'm sorry, what did you say, Norma? Okay, no problem. Okay, so she's saying right now that we're going to study passive with by. And the idea is what does a passive do to a sentence? Does anybody know what passive does to a sentence? The passive, do you know what it does to a sentence? It's an emphasis in uh, the sentence. Kind of emphasis. Okay, anybody else? No? No. Okay, no problems. Well, the other idea is, the idea of the passive is because the important is not who does the action. The important is what happens. What is the action? What is the activity? Not the name of the person and not who did the action. That's when we use the passive. Okay. So we can see we have three ways that we use it. Number one, who would like to read? We don't Thank you. All right. No, no, that's fine. Lisa, can you read number two also? Yes. There is no doer of the action. Correct. There is no doer of the action. That means we don't know which person did it. Okay. David, can you read number three, please? Okay. The fact is more important than the doer of the action. Correct. So the idea is doer is the way that we say the person who does the action. Okay. So whoever, when we say the doer, that's the person that does the action. So number one, we don't know who did it. For example, uh, a stranger, um, uh, someone at, at a party, we don't know. 
second, there is no doer in action. This means that the action happened, but not because of a person. For example, an earthquake or something like this. That could be another one. Okay, so when we have uh, a natural disaster, that's another way of the no doer. And three, the fact is more important than the doer of the action. That means that it's important who, what happens. I love the sound. Yes, I, I, I'm checking. This seems to be a problem with the sound. I'm not so loading this video. Okay, here what they're talking about is what is the difference? What's the difference between an active and a passive? Let's look at the two sentences. In the first part, the active, we have the president opened the building in 1931. But in the passive, it says it was opened by the president in 1931. Okay. David, what is the difference between the active and the passive examples that we have there? In the active, the focus is in the, in the person and the passive is in the object. Correct. Very good, David. As you can see, Norma, can you read the second example, please? An American architect designed the building. And the passive is the one designed by an American architect. Okay. Now, you see, it's not important the name of the architect. We don't know what architect. And we don't really care. The important is that it was designed by an American architect. So, only that it was designed. That is the idea of the focus of the passive. The passive is always, the idea is focused on what happened, not so much who did it. Like in the first example, the president opened the building in 1931. Oh, the most important was that it was opened. In this moment, do you have any questions? No, for the moment. Okay. Now, here, we have a scrambled sentence. That means this sentence is not in the correct order, okay? What do you think is the correct order of this sentence? My yeah. sister wrote this book in 2010. Please repeat the answer. My sister wrote this book in 2010. Okay, Lisa, do you agree? Yes, sorry. Daisy, no, it's okay, Daisy. Yes. Do you, you think it's correct what David said? Yes, my sister wrote this book in 2010. Okay, that's good. That is the correct answer. My sister wrote this book in 2010 because the focus is, if we can see, always on what happened, okay? My sister wrote the book is the active. Always when we talk about active, we can always think about the person. Which person did the activity or who did it? Uh, the name maybe is not necessary a name. Sometimes we say, oh, this person or a person did it, okay? Now we're gonna look at how we say the sentence with the passive voice, 
Okay. Do we have more people here? Oh, okay. We have many people. Great. Okay. So look at that sentence. What do you think is the correct one? My sister, this book by in 2010 written was. This book. In my opinion, in my opinion, my sister was written this book by, by in 2010. Okay. Anybody else would like to try? Thank you, Daisy. Okay. This book was written by my sister in oh. 2010. Ah, okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Now, the reason is because when we say this book, whenever we use the passive, we are focusing on, we change from the active, which is the subject and the verb and the object, and we change the order. The order is then the object first, not the subject first. So, as you can see there, what is the first thing? Always is the object. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Right? So, the object can be a thing. Is everybody okay for right now with the passive? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We're going to try a few exercises. Okay. So, hang on. Let me get these. Okay, here we have many different sentences. This is only in the present. We're going to use the idea for am, is, are. Do you remember how to use am, is, are? Yes. Thank you, Daisy. If you remember, just give me a, show me a finger and say, yeah, the finger that yes, you understand. Okay, I guess nobody else gave me the finger that yes, they understand, but we're going to continue. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, sorry. Could no. you explain me again, please? Okay. So if you understood, there's a, there's a place where you can put the, a finger, a like, that means that yes, you understand how to use the passive. So we can okay. practice. Okay. Okay, so let's try this. Each one is going to have one opportunity to do one. And um, Evasquez is going to do the first one. Daisy, you have number two, the cars. Jose, you have the kitchen. And let's see. Um, Alex, you're going to have many tools. Raul, you're going to do paper. Norma, you're going to use the one with I. Um, Gerardo, you're going to say the cows. Lisette, you're going to do the shop. David, I, and Norma Rivera, the presidents. Okay. Eva Vasquez, you ready? Um, I think that is Spanish um, was 
speak mm -hmm. in many countries. So, so, very good. Good idea, <laughs> but not the past. Remember, no, no, no. No it's past. Correct, but uh, the problem is uh, not the past. It's in the present. The present. Ah, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I, Spanish is, um, is speak, uh, is speaking in many countries. Okay, much better, much better. Spanish is spoken, always spoken. the past participle. Spoken oh, okay. in many countries. Thank you very much. Okay, number two. The cars are repaired by, by that man. man. Very, very good, that is correct. The cars are repaired because the cars are plural. Very good. Yes. And remember, repair is ED because it's regular. Yes. Okay, number three. The kitchen is cleaned every day. Good. That's very good. The kitchen is cleaned. The same thing, regular verb, so is ED. Number four. Many tools are produced from plastic. Okay, very good. That's correct. Many tools are because the tools, plural. Remember, whenever we have plural is are. Very good. Mm. Produced ED. Next one, number five. Paper is made from wood. Very good. It's irregular. So no is make it is made. Very good. Paper singular. Next one. Uh, I drive to a school by my mo by my boy. Okay. I repeat one more time. What was the answer? I drive to a school by my mom. Remember, you need a verb to be. What do you use with the verb to be? I am. I am. And you need the verb drive, not in the present. You need the past participle. Do you know the past participle of drive? Drive them. Yeah, Alex, think. please help. Driven. Good. Only the pronunciation is driven. Driven. Correct. Driven. Okay. Yes. Good. So the correct answer is, I am driven to school by my mother with N at the end. Here we put an N. We put driven. Like this. Okay. The next one, the cows. What? What? Cow. What is the answer, Gerardo? The cows? Are. Are. Do you need some help, Gerardo? Because my is so bad and I don't. No problem. I, don't, don't worry, it happens. It's, it's the first day we all have technical problems. No worry. Can somebody please help Gerardo with the correct answer? The cows are fed every morning. Very good, Jose. How do you spell the word fed? F E D. That's correct. The cows are fed every morning. Good. Okay. The shop. I don't remember who was the shop. Norma Rivera, was that you? The shop? Shop is closed by the manager. Ah, good. That's right. The shop is closed because it's regular verb. Good. For I? Uh, I am um, taking him to the hospital every week. Very good. That's correct. I am taken. And the last one? The president are elected by the people. Excellent. Are elected because it's a regular verb and the presidents are plural. 
Okay. Does everybody understand the passive in this moment? I understand in the present, the passive voice uses the verb in time of of uh, past past participle. Correct. That's right. The past participle. Okay. Always you use the verb to be and the past participle. In the present is am um, is are. In the past is was were. And the time for the verb is the another. No, no, the time for the verb, the same. Past, past participle. participle. Yes, always past participle. Any other questions? Okay. If there okay. are no questions, or, or yes, someone had a question? No, teacher. No? Okay. Perfect. Then we're going to continue with the idea for today's, the next part. Okay. Here, not in, here, not in this moment, but remember, oh, hang on. That always you need, let me go back just a little bit. There we go. All right. If you need, or if you would like to, to watch the complete video, you can watch the video in this platform, okay? This is the explanation, but if you need to watch again or see more examples, you can watch again tomorrow, okay? Remember, yes, that you can watch the video as many times as you want. In this moment, we are not going to do, but, but please remember that uh, tonight or tomorrow to do this, the idea of choosing the knowledge check, okay? Which is the correct form, okay? This is the practice of the passive, okay? okay. Everybody understand what you have to do? Yes. 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 Would you, would you like to practice time. Would you like to practice one more time the passive or do you feel it's okay? I'd like to practice one more time. Okay, let's practice one more time. Thank you very much. Very much, no problem. Here we have a couple of different answers. What I would like you to do, if everybody has a piece of paper or something in the house to write with if you or in the computer, I want you to write your answer and I will show you to see if you understand how to use it. I will give you a few moments, that way we can have it. Okay. okay. Let me see. With the simple per present. Correct, correct. With the simple present. So the same, the same that we practice here, we use the simple present, am, um, is, are, is the same, only remember that he always the verb in past participle. Okay, we have a lot of students today in today's class. That's good. We have 13. The connection is very bad. I hear you a little bit. Eva Vasquez, I'm sorry, I can't I hear you. I have to say Ah, okay. Yes. Yeah. Let me see. Okay. Can you hear me now? Is this better? No. No. My is for moment. Okay. It's like the the like the volume comes and goes, or like the connection is is good and bad for moments. Yeah. Yes. The connection because because volume is. It's good, but 
the connection is not. Okay. Okay. Anna, in this moment, can you hear me? Does or is is bad still the connection? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. But not always. Not always. He has interference. Yes. Okay. Let me see. Mm. Okay. We have to try to fix it. I'll I'll see what I can do in a little bit. Okay. Okay. Okay, so is everybody working on the the sentences? How to make it into the passive voice? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. I give you a few more moments, and then we check together. When you are finished, please uh, or give me a, a sign like a clap or a, a finger. That way I know when everybody is finished. Okay. Set the table by them. Anna, do you have number two? Mm, I have a doubt, teacher. <laughs> Let's try. Let's do it together. Go ahead. Mm. Uh, I don't know. I don't remember when this is true to pass a voice. Okay. Let's, let's help. Let's review a little bit. When, how do we begin the passive voice? Always we begin the passive voice with? The object. The object. Very good, David. So in this case, David, what is the object of the sentence? Uh, the table. Okay. The table. I think the sentence is the table was set by us. Very good, but not in the past, David. So yeah. let's try in the present. The table is set, is set, is set by, us. by us. Okay. Is set by us. Very important. If you see, we change the verb. The pronoun we, we change for us. Like he, we change for him. Because not do the action, receive the action. Okay. okay. Who would like to try number three? Me, teacher. Please. Uh, a lot of money is paid by her. Okay. A lot money is it's paid by 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 her by her. Okay, good, nice. That is correct. Very good. Who would like to try number four? Me. 
The picture Please. is drew by me. The picture is drew oh, by okay. me. Okay. Like this? Is this how you wrote it? Is D R E W W N? Okay. okay. Very good. Yeah. Is Drew is the past, but we need the past participle. We need drawn. 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 Uh huh. Then. But by me, but correct. Wow. The idea was correct, only the verb is past participle, not, not past tense. Who can do number five? Me, teacher. Okay. Uh, blue shoes are worn by them. Very good. Blue shoes. Here we use are because shoes are plural. Are blue worn. Shoes. Are worn by them. Thank you. Very good, Alex. Who would like to try the next one? Don't be scared. It's okay. We we all make mistakes. <laughs> this, is, <laughs> no. this is very difficult for me. <laughs> no, of course, of course. But it's better to make mistakes in the practice and no in the knowledge check. <laughs> Sure. They don't help you. Mm. They don't help you. Uh, you, you don't be helped by them. By them. Okay. You don't. You. They you don't, don't be helped. You will. Remember, um, only you verb to be. Only verb to be. What do we use with verb to be? Yes, sir. Are. 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 Aren't. Good. Are. You aren't. You aren't. You aren't. Helped. You aren't. By them. By them. Because By them. The, the object here yes. is you. You are the object. And the action is help. But remember, the verb to be is aren't. Because the, we have don't for negative. Mm -hmm. Adriana, would you like to try number seven? Yes. Um, the book isn't opened by him. Okay. That is correct, because the book is singular. Correct, very good. Any more volunteers or I select? Okay, let's go with Daisy. Daisy, what do you think is number eight? I cannot see very well. Ah, okay. Is you you what you? No, no. I see the uh, the table also. Blurry. Mm -hmm. Yes. Blurry. Blue. Blue. Yeah. Like blue, almost like the the color blue. Blurry. Blurry. Ah, yeah, ah, yeah. You do not write the letter. You do not letter. write the letter. Okay. Yes, number eight. You do not write the letter in the passive. The letter. The letter. Yes. You. You. Mm. Mm, the letter. You don't write the letter. Aren't aren't the aren't write. Is the letter you? singular or plural, Daisy? Is yes, sorry. Correct. It's isn't, isn't right by you. Isn't writing, yeah. written. Correct, mm -hmm. isn't written, isn't written. 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 by you. 
Because always is the past participle. Mm -hmm. okay. Who would like to try number nine? Alex, do you want to try? Um, seeing your that you uh, you you your your, your mom packet. Uh, it's a question, right? It's a question. It's different. <clears throat> it's a question. Mm -hmm. mm. So, yes. so with questions, the verb to be begins before the the object. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you picked up? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. By your, mom. by your mom. Excellent. That's correct. Are you picked up by your mom? Because it's a question. That's correct. Look at the last one. The last one is a question also. Are you? The sentence, okay, does the police officer you, catch the, the thief? Is you the police officer? Are the thief Are the thief captured by the police officer? Good idea, but the thief is singular, not plural. Is 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 is, is the police officer captured? Is the, is the thief is, thief is the thief? Ah. Is the thief thief? Out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are there any words here you don't know or any words you don't understand? It's okay for me. Thank you. Okay. This exercise was very good. Okay. I'm glad. I'm glad. The vocabulary is okay for the exercise? Yes. Yeah. yeah, it's okay. Okay, perfect. So then let's continue with the next part. Remember to do the knowledge check tomorrow. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Now we're going to look at the way the letter O is pronounced. In English, O has many different forms to pronounce. Sometimes you pronounce in one form with one word, and sometimes you pronounce in another form with another word. I hope here you can hear, but we'll try. Hmm. Can you, you can't hear, correct? No. No. We can't hear the okay. audio. Do you have some speaker connected? I, is. Do you I, have a, a speaker? No. Yes, let me try if I remove the speaker. Maybe like that you will be able to hear.
Okay. I'm going to explain how to pronounce. The first O is not top. It's like an uh sound. Not top. Not top. Correct, Anna? Yes, not teacher. top. Not top. Okay. Not the top. second pronunciation is like an O sound. Is no and do. No. Do. No. Good. No, no don't. don't. The next one is don't. like a U, like a U sound. Do. 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 Food. Food. Do. Food. And the last O is like here. One. Love. Love. One love. One love. One love. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm love. going to I'm going to repeat the words one more time so that you can hear all of the words. Is not top. Not top. Top. Not top. Top. Remember the word top is not top is with a p at the end, top. 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 Good. top. Then we have no and don't. No, don't. 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 Mm -hmm. no, don't. Good. Then we have do and don't. Sorry. Do and don't. <laughs> I will try to download the video tomorrow first. That way we don't have problems. Okay. And then we had, I think it was food. Ah, oh, too small, huh? I don't know why. Is my screen small for you guys? I see someone for... Yes. It's a little bit small. It's a little bit small. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for telling me. I... But in computer, this is good. Yeah. Okay. I don't understand why. Okay. Okay. Then we have do food. Do food. One love. One love. Okay. So you see the O has four different pronunciations. Yeah. One love. Mm -hmm. One love. Is this part okay? Has two sounds. Yes. Yeah. Has many sounds. Has the sound with not. Has the sound with no, yeah. do, yeah. one. one. Mm -hmm. So it's four different sounds. Not, Not. No. No. no, do, do, one. one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Any questions at this moment? No, teacher. No. No. Okay. What are the rules for the it is case? Ah, thank you. It's a very good question, Alex. Actually, the rule is each word is different because some words is not for the letters. Some words you have with an ah sound and others with you. But normally, when the word has two O's, you pronounce like you. Two O's like you, okay. Mm -hmm. So that's why many times when you go swimming, it's a swimming pool or food. Mm -hmm. Because okay. the two O's is like a U. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay.
Any other questions? No? No, teacher. Okay. I think it's important before you do the, the, the chat tomorrow, we practice one more time the idea of the passive because the passive is difficult many times. Yes, teacher, please. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, because I know it's, it's difficult. <laughs> okay. Here we have a little bit uh, idea with the picture. Okay. Here, the focus is only learning to practice the pronouns, how to change the pronouns. Okay. So what is the pronoun? Does anybody remember what are the pronouns? He drove. He drove the bus. Okay, but in, in the sentence, what is the pronoun? He bus. He bus. He is correct. He is the pronoun. So remember the pronouns are I, you, we, mm -hmm. he, she, she, it. Those are the pronouns. So here we don't say the bus was driven by he. How would be the correct answer, Raul? Sorry, So that for this one is the answer is not correct. The bus was driven by he. What is the correct answer? By him. Uh, the bus was driven by him by him good remember the pronunciation is driven driven, mm -hmm. driven. Mm -hmm. driven. yes driven. so the correct is by him by him mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the All bus right. was driving driving by him yes let's try a volunteer evasquez eva do you yes. have number two Try number, number two. two. Um, we solved the problem. The problem was solved for for we or for for us. Uh, for us. By us. By us. The problem was ah. solved by us. Yes, by us. By us. Good. Good <laughs> idea. Anna, help us with number three. Um, began um, was I can see the was began was shot by it by 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 them not by them by us, us. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. for remember for them is they they mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Lisette, do you want to try the number four? Yes. All um, all the room was were clean by me. Good. By me. Good. Mm -hmm. Alex, ready for number five? Number five. Okay. I was impressed by it. Good. Only the pronunciation here is impressed. Impressed. Good. Impressed. That's correct with T. Good, Alex. Impressed. Okay. Impressed. Good. Gerardo, number six. She was an email. And an email was sent. By her. Mm -hmm. ah, very good. That's correct. That's correct, Gerardo. By her. Daisy, you ready for number seven? Okay. Mm. The purple vase was chosen by him. Very good. By him. That's the vase for the flowers. Good. David, you ready for number eight? 
Okay. The door was closed by me. Very good. Very good. Only remember the pronunciation is closed. 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 Mm -hmm. closed. Good. Number nine. Norma? A person was giving a person was giving to him them. Ah, very mm -hmm. nice, very nice. Yeah, they try to trick you with him, but no, it's by them. Very good. Mm -hmm. Raul, do you want to try number 10? Okay. The house was, uh, the house was built uh, by them. That is correct also. Very good. The house was built by them. Excellent. Adriana, number 11. Okay. The thief was caught by him. By him. Very good. Okay. Very good. Uh, I don't know the name, but it says Galaxy Colocho. So I don't know whoever <laughs> Galaxy Colocho <laughs> is. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same Gerardo because in my I, you see I don't see the relation ah okay okay Gerardo right in, in my phone I I see the, the class ah okay okay Perfect. That's why I say, I, I don't know who this Galaxy Colocho is. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, Gerardo, try the last one then. You sound a lot of songs. A lot of songs were sung by me. By you. No, but by where you. is you? By you is the same. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Remember, by me is when we use I. I sang a lot of songs. Mm -hmm. Then we say a lot of songs were sung by me. Is better the idea? Yes. Yes, yes. Okay. All right then we are going to pause today. Remember to complete the exercise for the checkups. And also you have an activity for the writing where uh, you have the opportunity for the chat. I believe is in the first one for the passive. Mm -hmm. I see many examples. Okay. Hey, that's good. I already see some people. Mauricio, Jose Antonio, Noemi, Roxana. Okay, I see many people already participating. Remember to participate and we will take a look and review again tomorrow and continue the class tomorrow. Okay. okay. Thank you. Have a nice Good night. night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night.